everyone, my name is Tyler Oakley, and it is time for another Q and Slay. Danny would like to know, are you Jesus? And Danny, do I look like somebody who would only have 12 followers? No. Jocelyn would like to know, do you plan on having kids? And Jocelyn, no matter how hard I try, I cannot get pregnant. Us gays just keep trying and nothing is working. Um, so if you figure it out, yes, I would love to have kids. But until then, I guess I'll just keep trying. Would you ever adopt a Dorito and raise it as your own? Well, considering the fact that procreation is not a viable solution for all of the children that I would like to have, yes, adoption is 100% probably what I'm gonna do, but I would probably not adopt a Dorito because for some reason in our society, it's just frowned upon to eat your children. So that's just not gonna happen. Have you ever been caught picking a booger in public? No, I don't think I have, but today, I'm gonna tell you a story. Today, I was walking with Corey and we were walking down the sidewalk and I was picking a booger and he was in front of me so he couldn't see me picking my booger. But you know what? God was like, eh, eh I see you doing that and I'm gonna punish you accordingly and somebody's gonna see and I got a bloody nose. I got a bloody nose in the street because I was picking my boogers. Everyone knows, all my friends know I have sharp boogers. So I'm like, I, you need to get out of here. You will not live within me, get, because I just can't live with a sharp booger in my nose and I always have sharp boogers. So if I pick it, I get a bloody nose. If I don't pick it, I get a bloody nose. I'm damned if I do, I'm damned if I don't. This is the struggle. Maggie says, are there any new Nature Box items that you are raving about? And Maggie, let me tell you, girl, okay. Y'all know that I talk about Nature Box every single month now. Basically, all you gotta do is go to naturebox.com slash Tyler. You pick out a whole bunch of healthy foods. It's all like healthy snacks, but they taste good. Like no trans fats or no high fructose corn syrup. You pick whatever size box you want, and then they send you that box full of goodies. And let me just tell you, it's the best thing ever because you don't have to go to a store. And it just shows up to your door every single month. It's the best. I am currently loving these cheddar sourdough pretzels, they are heaven in your mouth. And y'all know I don't talk about something unless I can give you the hookup and they let me give you 50% off your first box. So if you use naturebox.com slash Tyler, that is the hookup. You're welcome in advance. The link is below. What is the first word that comes to mind when you think of a cucumber? Uh, <laughs> cold? How long until you reveal the project that you're working on? Patience. All good things come to those who wait. It's really, really, really fucking good. I want to tell you right now, but I can't. I'm just, I just, I'm just uh, <laughs> it's good. Trust me, it's worth waiting for. What is it like to have Corey back in your life on a daily basis? It is actually the best thing in the world, and I just love having him in my town now. If you don't know, Corey is my bestie, and he lives here now, and I adore him, and he is part of the secret project. Cat would like to know, will I pee on her? What in the actual heck, Cat? Kristen would like to know, who is my current OTP? For those of you who don't know, an OTP is your one true pairing, the two entities that you would love to see together in my OTP right now is this person who thinks that America is 2013 years old and this person who thinks that that person is an idiot and tries to correct them and says that the world is 2013 years old. What a pairing. Marina says, how does one pass physics? And I would have to ask you the same thing because Lord knows mama did not pass physics. I have no fucking clue. Nisa asks, what is Whitney Houston's favorite type of coordination? And I would probably have to say... And I, I, I will always love you. Riley would like to know, how was your day? And Riley, thank you for asking. My day was fabulous. I did so many cool things for you guys that I can't tell you about right now, but I want to tell you about, but they're amazing, so just stay tuned. But yeah, it was really good. Thank you for asking. It really actually warms my heart when I see people ask because it's like, you know what? You realize I'm a human. I'm not just some type of entity that you can ask to have pee on you. <laughs> Unless that's what you're into. So that is all the questions I have for this week. If you like this week's video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe right there. The latest Q&A is right there. And the last Friday video is right there. And if you want to be this week's person of the week, all you got to do is go to districtlines.com slash Tyler Oakley, get a shirt or a sweater or a poster, and send me a picture of you being cute with it. And I might put you right there. It's that simple. But yes, that is all I have for you guys this week. I hope you have a fabulous life. And I will see you guys next time. And until then, maybe on the internet. Okay, later. It's time for Q and Slay.